friends, especially her like students. I'm Mrs. Corcoran. I'm going to be reading a story to you today, but first I have a little announcement to make. I have two sons, Austin and Zachary. Austin is a Marine and he is currently stationed out in, in California. So over the winter break, the rest of my family, my husband and son and I, went out to California to spend time with Austin and his wife and his puppies. And we spent a whole week there and had a great time. And now that we've been stuck home for a couple of weeks, we've realized how much we really miss spending time with them. So after school is supposed to end, we are going to pack up all our things and sell our house, and we're going to move to California to spend more time with Austin and his family. And I just wanted to share that with you. So now I have a story to read to you, and it is called April Fool. The story is written by Harriet Seifert, and it's illustrated by Dem um, Chris Demarest. Today is April 1st, you know, said Will to Sam and Corey. Walk along to school with me, and I'll tell you a story. I once saw an elephant going to school. He had on a hat. It looked really cool. Really? Wow. Lucky you. His trunk was big. His tail was not. His eye was little. A tiny black dot. He raced with a bus that was going to school. He put back a flagpole that had fallen down. His back was long, his back was wide. He picked up five kids and gave them a ride. Really? No way. I joke. I am. It's not a joke. Come on. They're not believing him, are they? He lifted his leg. He did some tricks. He scared the kids with his elephant kicks. He stood on one leg and sang through his trunk. He started to juggle six bags full of junk. He opened his backpack. Inside was his lunch. He gave all the kids some peanuts to munch. Because we know elephants love peanuts. He packed up his backpack and he waved goodbye. Don't go, don't grow. I heard the kids cry. Liar, liar, pants on fire. His friends don't believe him. April Fool. So, boys and girls, April Fool's Day is a day where we tell people some little stories, little white lies that aren't necessarily true. But part of it being April Fool's Day means that we have to tell somebody that we're telling them a, a joke. So we always say April Fool when we're finished. So earlier, when I was telling you I was moving to California, I was just April fooling you. I'm not really moving. I'm not selling my house and packing up and leaving. I'll still be at Herlock Elementary. Have a great day. Have fun April fooling somebody. Make sure you tell them April fools when you're finished. Bye.